NEC NFL Draft Bible on location. Hey fans, this is Christian Kuntz and Miami Mike coming to you live from the Northeast Conference Media Day. And I am sitting here with the Duquesne star athlete and the conference's defensive player of the year. Congratulations on last year, and let's talk about this year. How are you feeling heading into your uh, senior season and the big season ahead? Mike, thanks for having me, first of all. And, uh, we're uh, we're ready to go. I mean, we're we're not, we're not looking back on last year. It's over now. So we're looking ahead to this year, and um, we're hoping to get back to the conference championship, to the playoffs, and hopefully win a couple games and make a little run and see what we can do. So we're looking forward to it. Once again, this is a first-team All-American linebacker here. We're sitting with 72 tackles last year, 10 sacks, four interceptions. This guy was all over the field. How do you do it week in and week out? Uh, it's just all the scheme and coaching and teammates. I mean, our, uh, every team we play, we come up with a new scheme. Um, the guys the guys that play in front of me, the guys behind me, next to me, they're, they're great. I mean, no one really cares about stats. I mean, honestly, I don't know. You make the tackle great, you cheer on your teammate. Um, we just kind of play for each other, and that's what kind of motivates you to win, motivates you to make this place. Yeah, speaking of the coach earlier, and Duquesne being right in the heart of Pittsburgh, in, in the Pittsburgh Steel City. Pittsburgh steal of football, Duquesne football. It's a big football city. And, and winning means a lot to the fans there, whether it's Duquesne or the Steelers. What are your thoughts on Duquesne winning the conference last year? And what are your chances of repeating the conference championship for this year? I mean, it's it's obviously big for us to win the conference and the, put us kind of put us on the map, go to the playoffs, um, and just to just to repeat, it's going to be tough like every other year. I mean, every team, no matter who you're playing, where you're playing, and that, it's going to be a tough game. Um, this conference, like, anyone can beat anyone at any time. So um, we're just trying to take it one game at a time, and whoever's in front of us try to play our best game. So now uh, Northeast Conference has a contract with ESPN3. We get some airtime on TV, some friends and family across the country get to uh, watch your bang heads your senior season. How excited are you to uh, have ESPN3 involved with the Northeast Conference now? That's awesome. I mean, just to get us, get us out there, more exposure. Um, whether we're playing or we're not playing on ESPN3, it's just like I said, it's great for the conference just to grow. Um, to get kind of guys, guys named out there that can really play. Um, and just kind of put our conference on the map, so it's great. Love it. Opening night is a Thursday night under the lights against Youngstown State. Huge, huge matchup. What are you thinking about today? Looking forward to that game. What are you thinking about at this moment for Youngstown State? I want to win the game. That's all I want to win. That's all I want to do. Whether I whether I play one snap or every snap, I just want to win the game. Um, we want to leave Youngstown on that bus as a winner, uh, and that's our goal. So that's what we're, we're we're working hard this summer to do, and that's what that's what our plan is. One game at a time, our first our first stop. So they they said to ask you about your long snapping. Is there something you want to share about that or, or tell our fans about your experience or what's going on? I mean, I'm just, they just razz me. I mean, I don't... Just, Are you trying to be the long snapper? I was, you, you're struggling or no, I, what's the story? Tell us the truth. We need to know. Uh, I was the long snapper last year and I think they they brought in a guy that they might, they might be able to steal the spotlight. It's a long snapper and another kid's been working at it. So they're trying to they're trying to get me off the field on special teams right now and I don't want it to happen. So. Well, uh, you know what? And, I, and, and, and that's great that you don't want to get off the field, but you know what? They may need to protect you because you are their All-American linebacker. You are the defensive player of the year in the conference and you know what so what if they bring in a freshman let him long snap you get a get a quick gatorade break and get right back on the field tell them to put you in on offense how about that i love your style that's what we've been pushing on i know, you know? i'm with i'm with the quarterback coachman and the offensive coordinator here you got some travel time with them get get the ball rolling tell them you don't want me to long snap get me in on some offense will you that's exactly i sat with them on the plane and that's why i was pushing it they tried to put their ear fence and i wouldn't let them all right well you tell them miami mike said when you got a big game and you're blowing somebody out yo remember miami mike interviewed us he said throw him in on an offensive play will you do it please 100 percent, absolutely hey listen thanks for your time good luck this season this is the uh, uh, conference player of the year all american from duquesne Right here, oh baby, Dylan, Be Cole, and Miami Mike coming to you from the NEC. <laughs>
media day. Coons. Game on. Buckle up, baby. We're live from New Jersey. Thanks, Cud. Thanks, buddy. Thanks. NEC NFL Draft Bible on location.